Hey guys, welcome back to DeFi Kingdoms. As with all my alpha drop videos, this one is also time sensitive because right now, hero prices are at historical lows. So if you have been looking to build up your hero army, now might be a good time to be doing so. This doesn't mean that hero prices can't drop any further, but rather that we have never seen hero prices at such low levels before. This is especially significant because I'm seeing many relatively good heroes being sold at below summoning costs. So in this video, I'll be taking you through the hero marketplace to see what are the good value heroes to be buying. Please note that none of this is financial advice, and it's simply what I consider to be good value buys. So here we are at the hero marketplace, and none of this has been sorted. This is just the basic lowest priced heroes, as you can see here, the floor price is 59 jewels, which is less than the maximum cap of a Gen 0 summon. So in general, what I will be looking to do is to look for cheap heroes that match with their preferred profession. So for wizards, for example, I would be looking for boosted gardening stats. Okay, So I'm just going to take you through an example of what I will be doing to look for good value buys. So first, wizard, I would be looking for boosted gardening. For Warrior, I would be looking for Boosted Mining, Thief, Fishing, and Warrior, Mining. For the Monk, my preferred profession would be Fishing, Archer, Foraging. As you can see here, this is a Boosted Foraging Archer at just 70 jewels. So this might be a good buy. Gen 5, not great. Zero Summons, not that great. Okay, so unfortunately, because this is zero summons, I'm not too interested in buying this hero at 70 jewels. So let's continue moving on and see if we can find any good value heroes here. For the monk, fishing, okay, pretty good because we can use the monk and summon with a pirate to get potentially a ninja. But you can see here, number of summons, zero. So this is one of the reasons why these heroes are selling for so cheap because there are so few summons left. But we might be able to find some good ones. For example, here for this thief, we see it's still full summons, although it's gen four and it's four summons, but at least the number of summons is full. So hopefully this is a fishing, uh, fishing thief. Nope, let's move on. Fishing, nope. Let's find mining, nope. Mining, nope. Gardening wizard, nope. Continue moving on. Gardening, nope, I would be looking for mining, 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 fishing, okay, not bad, a uh, fishing monk uh, with the dex boost, so this will help the ninja summon, let's see if there are any summons, for, okay, not too bad, for a 75 jewels, uh, it's pretty okay if you're looking to summon ninjas, okay, so this might be a generally okay buy, in my opinion, let's move on. Uh, no fishing. I will be looking for fishing here as well. Okay, so remember uh, for the monk and pirate, my preference is to look for the fishing profession so that I can potentially be summoning ninjas. For wizard, gardening, nope. Okay, knight, mining, nope. Gardening, okay, here we have a priest with full summons, although it's three with the gardening boosted profession. So 75 jewels, not too bad. Um, however, the number of summons is quite low. This is a gen 5. For 75, in this current market situation, is a little bit pricier than I would have liked. In other situations, um, when, for example, of just a few days ago, the floor price of even a common was about 175 to 200 jewels. So you have to adjust your expectation of what price is acceptable for what kind of hero based on the ongoing trend. So in this case, 75 jewels for a 3 summon Gen 5 Priest, although it's a boosted gardening priest, not too attractive in my opinion. Okay, so I would not be personally buying this um, priest. Let's move on. Mining, nope. Mining, nope. Okay, so as you can see, the, the price of jewels is looking to go up. Let's quickly uh, run through until maybe about 90 jewels. We'll see if you can find any good value buys. So far, I've only found that one hero earlier. Um, okay, I'm not, I'm not going to go through that again. I'm not going to waste your time. You can just go back in the video uh, to see what, what was the hero I was looking at. 
Okay, priest gardening, fishing. Okay, not too bad. This might be a generally okay buy uh, because of the stats here. We can see agility is good. It's great for the um, a ninja. So it's fishing. However, only two summons left. So this is kind of a borderline case. Personally, I would not be buying this um, hero. Okay, but if you are very aggressive on ninjas or you're very positive on ninjas and you don't mind paying a little bit more for a, a chance of getting a ninja, then this might be a good value buy. And uh, so this price is relatively okay. Okay, personally though, I would not be uh, looking to buy this hero mainly because there are only two summons left. Priest, gardening, nope, foraging, fishing. Okay, here again, 75 jewels for fishing for a monk is all right. Let's see the number of summons, six. Okay, so this is much better because we can have six chances of getting a ninja. So if I was looking to get a ninja, this would be a relatively okay price to be buying this monk. So let's move on. Gardening, gardening, fishing, foraging, fishing, gardening, foraging. Okay, so this is how I would be running through the marketplace to find a good value buy. So right now the market is quite efficient. I'm not seeing too many good deals. So far, only one earlier that I found. Nothing else here really catches my eye. If you have the time, it might be worth going through the whole list of heroes here until maybe about 100 jewels or so. So far, I'm not seeing any great deals, only that one hero earlier. Okay, uh, so you know what I will be doing next is to look for slightly higher priced heroes. Let's see if we, are, we have any good ninja deals. So just one or two days ago, the floor price for an advanced hero was about 500 jewels. But as you can see here, now the floor price has dropped more than 50% to about 200 jewels. So there might be some good deals to be found here. So for the ninja class, I will be looking for one with the boosted fishing stat. Okay, but as you can see here, the market is quite efficient. Not many fishing ones here. There's, here's one, a pretty good Actually, it's very good for a ninja because ninjas benefit from a high dex stat as well as a boost in fishing. So let's see if there are any summons in this ninja. If there are more than four summons, then I think this would justify a 349 jewel price. Okay, so four, kind of a borderline case, not too bad. If I was looking for a fisher and I could afford 349 jewels, this would be a generally good value buy in my opinion. So let's continue. One more fisher. Again, it's a dex fishing ninja. Three summons. Okay, not great, especially when it's a higher price than the previous one over here. If I were looking to collect ninjas, then I might be buying these two. But of course, if I could only buy one, then this would be the one to get. All right, so this is for ninja. Let's move on and see if we can find any good paladins. Okay, so for the Paladin class, I will be obviously looking for mining or gardening here, a gardening Paladin, agility, okay, not ideal, but at least this Paladin has the boosted gardening profession. Okay, one out of two for 300 jewels, uh, borderline case. Personally, I would not be looking to get that. Let's see if we can find any others. Okay, mining here, strength, oh, that's very good for a Paladin. Uh, and mining plus a little bit of luck. Three summons. Okay, for 300 jewels, it's also a borderline case, uh, but you know, I think this is a better deal than this one because at least this has three summons and this has only one left. Okay, so personally, between the two, I would prefer to get this paladin if I were looking to get paladins. Okay, so you can go through this whole process with whatever hero you're looking for. Generally, I think this is a good time to be loading up on heroes, not financial advice, of course. It's just that heroes are right now selling at a historically low price. So if you're looking to get any particular class or particular type of hero, now will be a good time to go bargain hunting. Okay, I hope this video has been helpful. If you would like me to make more Alpha Drop videos, please click the like button, leave a comment, and don't forget to subscribe. Thanks for watching guys and I'll see you in the next video.